Hey everyone, it's Mickey Made It, and I'm excited to introduce you to Inspired by Dreams, my preppy streetwear brand. See, this line is all about blending the classic and the contemporary, bringing you stylish pieces that are unique as your dreams. So whether you're hitting the streets or just chilling out with your friends, our collection offers the perfect mix of sophistication and urban edge. Join us in redefining streetwear fashion and let your style be inspired by dreams. Check out our latest collection and become part of the dream today. Greetings, greetings, all my dreamers and dreamettes. It's your boy, Mickey Fenty, AKA Mickey Made It. If you're new to this channel, you ought to do to this channel. Subscribe right now. And if you want to support the brand, you guys make sure you check me out at inspiredbydreams.shop and that's dreams with three z's at the end i got everything from hoodies crop tops snapbacks beanies t-shirts you got a little bit of everything to keep you neat and your drip is right for you, for you going out there okay remember i told you guys i had a couple reactions this one right here this right here this right here is crazy all i got to say I, i'll give you guys a title when baby mama crashes the party it gets violent I got to say people don't play about theirs people don't play about theirs so let's just jump right into it see what's going on this is going to be my first time reacting to this myself so everything from this point on is going to be a surprise so let's just jump right in there and if you're new to this channel y'all make sure y'all like and subscribe to the channel we got a lot more coming all right let's get it after reports of a fight between a man and a woman arriving at the scene officers found a woman in the hallway claiming the apartment was empty upon arrival Upon entering the residence, officers were met with a shocking sight. The apartment was in complete disarray, what? resembling the aftermath of a hurricane. Despite the chaos, the woman insisted on her innocence, stating she'd found the place in this state. Katrina. There's nobody in there. Huh? There's nobody in there. Who you live with? I live with my mom. I just came over here to see what was going on. Your mom lives with who? Um, my mom lives in Riverdale. Nobody's inside. I just came to see what was going on over here. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> That's a lie. Straight up. Who's inside? Nobody's inside. I swear. You sure who's inside? What is she doing in there? Open the door and you can stand outside. We're gonna check the apartment. Nobody's inside. Stay right here. Wow! Ah! police! Uh -oh. police. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm confused right now. I'm very confused right now. That place looks like a whole stampede of football players ran through the place and just started tearing. What is going on right now? What do you normally do when I'm gone? Wait for you to get back. Man, it, it went down. It went down, yo. It went down. This is crazy. Hey, there was that male in that parking garage. Uh, I think it's medium to short, uh, medium to long dreads, just standing back by there. He was just standing there, but I don't know. destroying this property. I'm gonna check the car history. So you gonna tell us what happened? I just came over here to see what was going on and I came into this, so. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> you know, she knows more than we know. Who called you out there? What's going um, on? The people outside. Your my father, my baby's father. father. Hey, there was that male in that parking garage. And I came over here and this was like 
like this. So I'm like, and that Mercedes. Uh, I think it's medium to short, uh, medium to long. Dreads. Dreads. Just standing back by there. He was just standing there, but I don't know if he's really bald or anything. But she heard her say she came and seen what was going on. This um, definitely somebody. Why does she have blood on her back? Let's look. Let's look. Let's look. Let's look. Let's look. You got an ID on you? Um, no. What's your name? You need an ambulance? No, I'm okay. Uh, no. Yes. Yes. She had blood on her clothes, but denied any knowledge of the situation. However, Officers noticed blood droplets on the floor, raising suspicions. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> <laughs> but it's on your back. Yeah, I know. So what was going on? So it's blood dripping, which you don't know what's going on, but it's on your back. Yeah. Come on, sweetheart. You know what's going on. So, what's blood come on your hand? What did you touch? I touched, um, it's something, I touched some glass in there. And it sliced my hand open like that. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> <laughs> that was yeah. yeah. Let let's see if we can get property managers information to identify who lives in that unit so we can figure out what's going on. Yeah. Yeah. Through conflicting stories, a narrative began to form. The woman eventually admitted her baby father was bleeding and that there were other women present. It's genius. Yeah, we all. Um, I stay here, but I don't stay here anymore. But my name was. I mean, is either you live here or you don't. But I if live you were here, here. I, I mean, I don't. So let me. My name is on the lease. So listen, because what you're saying don't make sense, and I'm gonna tell you why it don't make sense. For one, you covered in blood. Two, we came here for a domestic dispute. That's your Impala or Chevrolet? That's right there. Okay. So I'm gonna ask you again, what happened? With you and whoever was in that house. Okay, okay, so my name is on that lease, but I came over here and all that was already happening. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> <laughs> and what, what you mean, what was already happening? What was in there? I don't know what happened. So, whatever happened when I wasn't here, because they called me on the phone and I was on my way over here to see what was going on. And so he was bleeding. Christian. Who was bleeding? Um, who was... Christian. Who was Christian? Out there. He was bleeding. He... Hey, so she's saying Christian, some guy out there. Died. So yeah, the guy that's out there now. He was bleeding, and he walked out here, and I touched some glass in there and cut my hand. And yeah. So who was Christian? You. That's my baby's father. It's yeah. She involved. That he out there. So it must have been between both of them. They must have been arguing and going back at it. So he out there. Don't touch that door because it's got blood on it. That's your baby father. He left at the other So this is your apartment. You do live here. No, I don't. Y'all must I live at my mother's house in Riverdale. But, okay. yeah, I would just. So your baby daddy live you here. You traveled all the mm -hmm. So who did all that to the, the house? I don't He just had some girls over here. They just okay. recently left. What, what other females were here? I'm not sure the girls. There was some other girls here. I'm not sure who the girls was, but they just left. So what's your reason for coming over here? Because they called me over here because some- Who was they? Um, my baby father. He so he me. called you over here for what? It was some, I guess it was some- No, 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 he called you over for what? He just don't because call Because it was something that going on, obviously. What was going on? I guess it was some arguments. What was, uh, and you came to do what? <laughs> <laughs> to see what was going on. So you came to see what was going on because he called you over here. So how close were you when, you, when they called you? Probably like 20 minutes away. You was on your way. She was on her this way. This just was going on. Her way. No, this just happened. 
So who the girls that you got? I'm not sure who the girls were. But what, what did they have on? How many was it? It was two girls. Um, not really sure what they had on. I think it's some flip flops in there actually. I'm not sure exactly what they had on. Cause it was like the, I was coming and they was going. So y'all never stop this. Real quick, number one. She know her baby father, he is not being faithful to her. She know this because she was already on her way to this place before it went down. So she was on her way to fight whoever was up there sleeping with him, not realizing the reality of this is that he's not going to stop what he's doing. So she's going to have to be keep fighting and fighting and fighting. <laughs> and you think she's going to win every fight? Now there's blood on the ground and this could turn into something criminal. Let's just jump right back into it. Her ex-partner's friend confirmed a little party with two girls, further complicating the story. What's up, man? What's your first name? Jaquan. Naquan what? Jaquan. You got your ID on you? Yeah. Come on, Did you dude. hear anything what recently go, go down, or? I know you've been sending out her for a minute. With her. Yeah, um, my friend and them got the ID on him, but Who, What's your friend's name? Christian. Okay, that's why you're chilling here, because you wouldn't have picked him up? No, I just wanted to make sure he was straight. But I'm really just sitting here waiting to figure out which one of my girls I'm going to go pull up on. I got you, bro. Okay. So where's where's Christian at right now? I honestly don't know. Because you know there's blood all over that hallway. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I honestly don't know. Like, I called him, they ain't answered. His girl, well, his baby mama done pulled off. It was baby mama drama. Baby mama done pulled off. I'm like, I ain't got Were no they problem. in the room together, or were they in the apartment together at one point? I mean... Or did she just well, pull up to well, a vacant apartment? Who lives here? My boy Hutch. My boy Christian. Christian, okay. Yeah. But, got name, when she pulled up, well, it was with two girls. Damn. So, when, when they pulled up... I just walked out the room with the two girls. I, but the two girls left their shoes and their purse, so I had to go in. When I went in, I did see them chasing each other. So both <laughs> Do y'all live here? I don't live here. Or you just stay here from time to time? No, I just was here with my boy Hush because we just okay. came from being drunk. This is Christian? Yeah, no, this ain't Hush. Oh. Okay. So what a dude that was in the back seat? Okay, so what else, what, so you walk in, grab the purses, what else do you see? Uh, that place a whole bunch of stuff they around, like flowers. That. that place is a Christian was inside? Who was chasing who? No, uh, baby mama was chasing Christian. With what, just open hands, with what? Um, I ain't see all that, they were just chasing each other. No, okay, I, where's I, Christian at? Because it, it'd be really helpful if he could let us know what's going on. Um, you said he was in the back seat? He was in the back seat, had on red and black. He was in the back seat. Yeah. When we pulled up. I don't know where he went, like that's what I'm saying. I didn't what way did he walk? I guess you say I don't know that way. I am telling you. Like, Alright, bro. You gonna turn you gonna look, there's blood on your car. Now I gotta tow your car. You want me to tow your car? car? There's blood on my car. There's blood on your car. You see what I mean? You know I'm saying, so what y'all want me to say? Yo, I need Christian back here so we can know what's going on. What's going on? Return to question the woman further. However, her story remained unchanged. She insisted she was called to the apartment by her baby father, who was apparently involved in an argument. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> Report. Okay. So you're gonna be honest, honest with me, okay? Mm -hmm. What happened? Okay. I can't, well, he I don't want you to lie. Okay. Um, he called me on the phone. Oh, Christian. He Who's called me Christian on the phone. Uh, my baby father. He called me on the phone. He was like, there's some argument going on over here. So I came over here, and that was already like that. He was walking out. That's why I got this blood trail. My hand is bleeding because I picked up. You say he called because of what? Because there was some argument going on over here. And I pulled up. It was two girls walking out. I don't know who they was, don't know what they had on for real. But it was two girls walking out as I was walking in. He was walking, walking out from the apartment, apartment or walking? Do you know the two girls? No, I don't. It's black, white, green. <laughs> what do you normally do when I'm gone? Wait for you to get back. Um, I think it was black. Yeah, 
yeah, black. Um, yeah, he was walking out. That's why the blood is on the floor. And that was, and then y'all came. Those females, they looked like they were injured. No, I don't think I really didn't get no view of them. Cause like I said, as I was so coming, were, you said they were black. Yeah. Where they weren't. I didn't get no view of them. I didn't. I didn't really get a view of them, so I'm not sure what they had on, what they looked like. They was probably maybe. And which way they go? Out this door. Out the door, and you don't know where from there. No. Okay, after they that. They're going, they're hiding. Um, they are hiding. He, he, baby, he father is hiding was in that he walking door. behind him? No. They he walked out, that's why the blood trail. And where were you at when he walked out? I was walking right out now. too, and then y'all came. He so heard the horn. You came here, two girls pulled out, they went towards the garage. When you came inside the hallway, was he walking out? As well behind them, or no, he was still in the apartment. He was still in the apartment. So did you go to the apartment? Me? Yeah. Yeah, I went. To, I, I would just. So you went inside the apartment. You saw him. Saw Christian inside. Mm-hmm. What he, was he doing? Nothing. He was just standing there. How did he look? Um, in the stroke. <laughs> <laughs> he looked what? In the stroke. In the stroke. In the stress. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Yeah. Did he was he did, he did he see blood on him? No blood. I think he had some on his elbow. I think that's where that came from. Was it a cut? Mm, I'm not sure. Did, was he wearing uh, clothes or did he have no shirt? Or? Yeah, he had clothes on. What was he? What was he wearing? Um, I think red pants and a white shirt. I think. You know his full name at birth? No, I don't. How long you know Christian? For like seven years. For like seven years. How old is he? Uh, 25. What kind of hair does he have? Black hair. Short, long, curly, box. afro. Box, curly box. Tattoos? Mm, no. She know the girl, man. She been watching her on social media. Okay, so he walked in, he was in distress. What happened? And then that's when he walked out. Did he I say anything to you? No. He, he just, just walked out, and I walked out as well. And then that's when y'all came. So right before we came, where did he go? Did he go to? See when that description is opposite of the description of herself, that means her man is into randoms. Going this way, if I'm not mistaken. Left? Yeah, to the You know where he was going? No. It'd be different if it, she had looked like the same, then you know he's into, you know, that type, but it's, it's just totally opposite, random. It's that way. What, does he drive? No. He has no car? No. What's his phone number? Uh How you get blood on you? Um, I picked up a glass in there and it just cut my head. You sure? Yeah. And how did you get on your back? A white. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> back. Her hair is like this. No, no, it's up here. I'm not, I don't know. I don't know. It was a lot going on. I'm not sure how I got on my shirt. I'm gonna start lying now. <laughs> he probably touched me. I don't know. All right. Girl, could you stop wiping your face? Mm-hmm. You better be telling me the truth, okay? For sure. You tell me you lie to me. I can't help you out. Okay? Where do you live? I live in Riverdale. Finally, his friend called and urged him to return to the apartment complex to clarify the situation. Hello? You got to talking to me. You got to talk to me. They're <laughs> talking about uh, who was parking. So, I'm just like, Tell him he needs to show up. I'm just like, I don't know what they're talking about. They're talking about they're going to tow my car. Because they some good on my car. Like, I ain't even got nothing to do. Like, what I'm doing? I don't know what you and Shawty Pat going. Huh? 
No, I'm not talking to them. You just like, I don't know where nobody went. I don't know, like, nothing for real, bro. Like, I really don't. I'm trying to talk to you, bro. Like, what y'all got going on? Oh, he's ready to write something up. Oh, he's ready to write it up. Nobody, yeah. Oh, huh? Yeah, I got his, his license. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to run your name. All right? He needs to show up here before we, we start playing games. Okay? Yeah, enough with the games. Let me bring it up a little, see where they're going with this. Okay, so have him show up now because there's blood on your car all over it. Give me, give me, give me. Huh? He came in the spot. My cousin was already here. Mm -hmm. My cousin was already here. And she, she, she went in the spot, took the TV. I see the star going on a rampage. Like. Why didn't she go on a rampage? So this is your house? Yeah, like this both of our house. Like her name on the like she like cold on the piece. Uh huh. Yeah, so like I'm chilling. I'm in there chilling, bro. Like she came in, threw the TV off the wall, like started going back. I'm like, why you here? Like this is crazy, like. Yeah. I, 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 I can pull back up and like I'm not tripping, like I'm bleeding. Yeah, I mean, we can have EMS on the way here. It, it would have been a little faster if you would have. It would have been straight if you. It, it would have been better if you would have just stayed and we could have had EMS here. We could have kind of wrapped you up until they got here. I'm pretty sure they would have got here faster than, you know, you going to the hospital because we need you on scene. Yeah, pull pull back up so we can talk to you because um we just trying to get what's going on. Like you know, we it's an investigation and you leave. And if you telling us you got stabbed, then, you know, we, we got to do our job. But if you leave, why, you know, and not tell us? I mean, you saw us pulling up, so it's crazy for you to just leave like that. Uh, yeah, 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 pull back up, and then we'll have EMS. But I need to know if you really going to pull back up and not just playing with us. He's telling pulling us back you gonna... up, he's going down. Okay, how far are you? You good? Yeah, I'm... Oh, he's stuck. Crazy. You got any guns on you or anything? No, 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 no. Just double check. Bro. Yeah, I got none on you. This is wild, bro. What happened, bro? You got really fucked up. Look, we are chilling. I swear to God. Let's sit down over here. Let me talk to you. How old are you? I'm 25. Where's the window, bro? We're chilling in the house, bro. I'm good, look. She's right. going crazy. Okay, start from the beginning. Look, we're chilling. Look, the door opened in my house, right? Like, this, this, is, my, this is my boy, his cousin. They're in the house. Oh my bad, okay. They in the house, right? So I'm gonna phone my cousin telling him like my, my girl like how like me like I really like I got caught up with a female. Right? My phone's up, I got a call with a female. Okay, she pulled up out of nowhere. Who you your baby mom? My baby mom, she pulled up out of nowhere, came in the house. She they in there sitting on the couch. She threw the TV down. After that, it's probably going crazy. Throwing my clothes across the balcony. I'm like, what are you doing? They're young. He can't handle his commitment being faithful. And she's young. She can't handle her emotions. Yeah, I mean, boom. She said what? She stabbed me. Like, like she had a knife in her hand. He trying, he trying to get his stuff and stuff. Like, he's trying to get his stuff. I'm like, tell her to leave. Like, she's coming in back and forth. I'm running around. Crazy, like, though. Thing. She's like, she stabbed me. Boom. How many times? Like, once. And it caught me, like, right here, I'm bleeding, I'm calling, I'm calling, I'm calling, like, my whole, my whole thing, like, bloody, like. So, did she stab you inside or outside? Outside. Like, she was chasing me. She was chasing me. At what point she stopped chasing me? Uh, probably, like, I'm, I'm right here. I say, like, right here, like, like, inside. Like, inside, like, like Close to your apartment? The hallway. Yeah, like, hallway, so I'm running. And I'm like, bro, just leave me alone. Huh? Huh? You wanna talk to me? Call, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm, I'm barely. I don't know. I just he just pulls up. So I'm getting his side of the story. Okay. Yeah. Again, I got sad, bro. Okay. She's in trouble, y'all. Number one, he's crazy for doing all that, but she's in trouble from the way she reacts to the situation. This man. Let's see what's going on. Just take a seat over here, boss. She'll bring you the paper so you can write it. All right.
What exactly did you see? All of them. So today awesome. is her birthday, so we came here. That's her cousin. That's her cousin. I'm her best friend. So we came here like 11.50. <laughs> mm -hmm. A couple minutes to bring her birthday in over here before we went out. We are going to go out tonight for her birthday. And yeah, we were just chilling there. The clock had just hit 12 o'clock. And we were making videos saying happy birthday, blah, blah, blah. And then his child's mother or whatever uh, came in the house and she just said, oh, y'all are having fun? Yeah, we were. She said, oh, y'all having fun? And she just went up to the TV, started yanking the TV off the wall. And then uh, as soon as we saw her do She did all of that? To our car and we sat in the car to make sure he was okay. Okay. And um, we stayed and like she literally had a butcher knife. Literally, I never seen anything like that before. But she literally had a butcher knife chasing him. Okay. Butcher knife and he got. Do you know stabbed. what the butcher knife looked like? Like a like a literal. Where did she stab him? Outside or inside? I don't know. I took a picture. You, she was in the car. You took a picture of him. Yeah. I didn't get a good picture, but I got a picture. Because I was just in tall shower. What's that? Okay, but that's him. You know where it happened at? Like, we were all. He was just leaking. Oh, so he just came back up to like, you. Yeah. So did you guys see. see, didn't see the did you, you didn't happened. see the Did you see her running with a knife? We saw her running with the light. Up and down here? Like, okay. up and down that hall, cool. right? She there. came at you. She when, came. Because he came yeah. up to the car and was like, she just stabbed me. He was bleeding. I gave him some napkins yeah. out of my car. And then yeah. she. So I gave him napkins. We all was just sitting right here. And I was like, you better just want to make sure he's good before I pulled up on him. And literally, she came out. She's ran about the asthma car and everything. And she started chasing around the parking lot. And we just stayed there. And she came out one more time. Um, he was okay before we pulled off. Okay. And then I was literally leaving, and then he was like, "He take me to the hospital." Yeah. And but she didn't okay. even she didn't even acknowledge us. Like yeah, she, she was just strictly after him. Yeah. For whatever reason. Okay, so when he's done with that, just go ahead and write down what you've seen too. Okay, on on separate piece of paper. That way, we can have your written statements. All right. Yeah. After that, once once we get all that, you're good to go. Same thing, basically. Okay. Okay. The woman's initial denials and inconsistent stories ultimately led to her arrest. All right, ma'am. Black here. Three is ready. Can you go ahead and start brown, brown for one? All right, ma'am. Go ahead and turn around, face away from me. Look, you guys, when it comes down to this domestic violence, we already see how crazy it can get. I mean, I couldn't believe somebody, that small chick right there, tore up that whole place, ended up stabbing him. It got crazy and it could have got worse. Somebody could actually have, could have lost their life. So this is what it, it boils down to. The side chick's winning this one because he had a crazy baby mother. And it just goes to show, that's not the type of baby mother that's going to, eventually she's going to end up hurting him way worse than just stabbing him. So I don't know, man. Stop the violence and stop sleeping with people that you don't want. You know, I'll give them the benefit of the doubt. They had some years in and he was in the wrong of sleeping and, and sleeping on her. But you can't go around and just use violence as a way of your outcome. Just leave. Just leave. Until next time, it's your boy Mickey Fenty, a.k.a. Mickey Made It. 